Hello and welcome to Climbing Daily. Learning to move fast in the mountains is an essential skill for any alpinist. During the Arcteryx Alpine Academy, we climbed a classic ridge line with alpinist and mountain guide Stian Hagen. There are some great tips in this video and it will really bring your mountaineering level to the next level. My name is Stian Hagen, I'm an Arcteryx athlete and the mountain guide here in Chamonix and we're at the Chamonix Academy and today we're going to learn a little bit about moving fast and efficiently on uh, Alpine Ridge. So come with me and you'll get a little master class. So for fast and efficient movement in the mountains, preparation is uh, a key factor and uh, one of the things that you need to uh, get right is how you pack your backpack with your gear. So one of the things that is important when you pack your backpack is to put stuff in the logical order in the pack as of uh, how you're going to use it throughout the day. Look at the guidebook, look at the route you're doing and think about how things are going to pan out and then try and uh, pack your bag accordingly. So for tip number two, let's head up into the mountains and we'll uh, look closer at how to use the rope to move efficiently on the Alpine Ridge. To save time and move efficiently, there's basically two different uh, ways of using the rope. You can pitch it, uh, which is basically what you do when you, um, one guy's leading and the second follows after, which is the slowest way, but also the safest. And that's the technique we use when the climbing gets a little bit more difficult. When climbing eases up, we start moving together, which we also is known as short roping, where um, we move both uh, parties of the team at the same time. So tip number three is basically if we're going to pitch a whole route, it's going to take way too long. So at certain times we need to move together and when we're moving together on the, on the Alpine Ridge, we often use natural futures along the ridge to uh, make it safer. So we flick the rope over a rock horn, behind a flake, stuff like that. And we use some natural anchors in a way to make uh, movements as safe and efficient as possible. For uh, these rocks to work as protection, then you need to be able to flick the rope over so that if any of the parties, either the front or the back in the party falls, they'll be able to catch the fall, the rope will hang on the rock. So obviously uh, one of the huge advantages of using natural rock horns and, uh, and flakes and stuff like that for protection is that it's very quick. There's nothing to put in, there's nothing to remove. So we can move in a very efficient way. To make that decision on if you're gonna pitch it or if you're gonna move together, it's kind of up to you as a, as a leader of the team and uh, to be able to understand, is there a potential falling here? How hard is the climbing gonna be? Obviously it depends on how good of a climber you are, but if you feel like this is something that looks difficult, obviously you pitch it and you come into the terrain that you think this is looking easy, then you start moving as a team and uh, move both at the same time. So that was my tips for how to move fast and efficient on the Alpine Rock Ridge. Uh, obviously, if you wonder about anything and you're unsure of uh, how to do it, get a guide, uh, join a course, join something like the Arcteryx Academy and uh, learn more about it. Cheers to Stian and thank you Arcteryx for running such an amazing event. We've released a load of tips videos in this little series, so check them out for all your climbing and mountaineering skills. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.